Hey guys, Trevor here. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how to check your Safari history after it's been deleted on your iPhone. It's pretty quick and easy, so let's jump right in. Now let's open up the Safari app here on your iPhone. And you can always check the history just by tapping on the little book icon at the bottom right. This will show you your history. Keep in mind if you're on your bookmarks here, just tap on the little clock and it'll show you that history. However, what happens if you hit clear and you delete all of these or one by one you swipe over and hit delete? There are a couple different options to be able to find that history. One is let's go into your settings here and we'll scroll down until we get to Safari and scroll down to the very bottom and tap on advanced. Now you'll see at the very top is website data. Let's tap on that and this will show you all of the data associated with various websites. This is all of the cookies, cache information that has been stored on your phone associated with a variety of different websites. Now once this loads, you'll be able to see a list of every website that you have visited even if technically you deleted that browsing history, maybe there's some cookies or cache that are still on your phone and they might show up on here. For some reason, this isn't loading, but you'll be able to see it on this. Now, another place to check is let's go back here. Go to the very top, tap on your name and then iCloud and let's hit show all and Safari here, you can see it is toggled on, indicating that Safari is uploading to my iCloud all of my history and information, all of that stuff. So what you're gonna check is any other device that you have associated with your Apple ID. So if it's an iPad, if it's a Mac computer, another iPhone, you're gonna check Safari on those to see if you can see that deleted history on there before it has been updated and synced with the iCloud. You can go see if that history is on that device. I hope this helps. If it did, hit the subscribe button down below. It really helps me out. And I'll catch you on the next one.